we're part-time farmers and what that means is it's our hobby. We love raising livestock because it brings our family together. We've been in the 4-H volunteer program for at least 20 years. Both our kids got involved in 4-H and then in their later years in the FFA program. We showed sheep, goats, steers all over Pennsylvania. On Saturday mornings, we load up the truck and trailer and take off to a show. And then can't wait till next Saturday to go to the next one. The involvement with range resources in our livestock sale has been actually increasing over their, their time here in the county as they've found more ways that they can help us. The guys from Range Resources enter the building, they sit down, they generally buy the first animal out, and they're there till the last animal sold. The kids will come into the show ring and there's thousands of people standing, cheering. The excitement level comes from the bidding wars that go on between, say, Range Resources and a, and a partner of theirs. When a record price is being paid, there's a lot of excitement. You see the look on the kids' faces, the smiles, and sometimes you get tears of happiness. It's just an overwhelming feeling. When a sale is made and the auctioneer hauler is sold, that child has to take the paperwork to the buyer. So they meet face to face with these people from range. They go and shake their hand and the kids will know them by their first name and not out of disrespect for that. That's, they, they feel that they've met a friend. In the state of Pennsylvania, agriculture is the number one industry. And the part-time farmers like myself and, and so many other of us, we make up a big part of that, you know, whether you're a, a flower grower, a vegetable grower, or a small livestock farmer like us. And I think as long as range is here, the agricultural community will benefit.